through or the fact that I'm watching way too much Gilmore Girls. You need it in your wardrobe. Hello everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. I hope you're all really, really well. Guys, I am back with an actual fashion video. It is a haul and I'm so excited because this is possibly the biggest H&M haul I have ever done. And of course, it was a product of Black Friday. Um, H&M had a really good discount actually. Uh, some things were on sale and then members had an extra 20% off. So I placed a massive order. I just ordered everything that I liked the look of and I thought might as well see what I like and then if I don't like it I can send it back and you know no harm done because the items were a lot cheaper than they originally would be. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to get straight into the video, but if you're new here, please, please, please subscribe if you enjoy the video and give it a like too if you can. Um, but yeah, let's get into it. Guys, I've just started getting changed into the first outfit, but I forgot to show you the size of the box. Look at the absolute size of it. That is absolutely crazy. I don't know if I do have anything to return. I'm going to have a job of it, aren't I, trying to package this back up. But Starting off with something very different for me. I've just knocked over my boot. Um, but it's, I have been super inspired by the kind of schoolgirl uniform looking outfits, um, especially in winter. I don't know if it's like the Parisian, Parisian kind of style coming through or the fact that I'm watching way too much Gilmore Girls. Um, but I'm loving the sweater vests, the shirts and the little pleated skirts and together I thought it would be a match made in heaven but there's just something not quite right with this outfit. I have on this cotton shirt that's so strange, like it kind of skims in at the waist but then the shoulders are really dropped shoulders and like baggy arms, I just, I just don't think it's the, the shirt. It's not the shirt. It was only £20, but I'm not going to be keeping it. It's just a bit weird. Um, but I thought I'd style it with this little cashmere blend sweater vest. I thought that was amazing that H&M were selling such affordable kind of cashmere blend items. This was £40, but obviously in the Black Friday sale, it was more affordable. Um, and I don't have any in black. And I thought it would look really, really cute with this little pleated grey skirt. Um, and I do like the two together, however the sweater vest has quite a high neck so it's quite, you can't really pull a shirt collar over the top. I've kind of tucked it in, I don't know, it just looks a bit off and I'm not absolutely loving it. I think maybe styled a different way, it would look nice but I, my vision's just not really come to life which is a bit disappointing. However, I really, really love the skirt. So previously I've tried many different pleated skirts from H&M and they all seem to be like just just coming to the end of the bum like it they are just so so short and it's ridiculous because I'm only like five foot one um but this seems to be the perfect length it fits me really nicely round the waist it even comes down a little bit lower at the back so I'm not showing my bum off to the world um, but I think the idea of this outfit is super cute, but it's just it's just not there. Um, but the skirt I think was like twenty nine or twenty five pounds or something like that. So I think I will be keeping it. Um, I think it's going to be a great basic to have for autumn winter, and it can be styled in so many different ways. It's one of those classic pieces, really, isn't it? It's not really going to go out of style. These skirts come back year after year, um, and I think this one's a really nice kind of classic one, and it's it it fits nice and everything. So I do think it's worth keeping in my opinion just to show you the shirt on its own here i don't know if you can see if what i mean by it's weird like if i pull it out of this thing i mean this video is so haphazard just now um but it's like fitted at the waist but it kind of balloons out i don't know actually i have seen this style on a few other influencers but this just looks ridiculous on me i'm not cool enough for this style of shirt like definitely not i need like a classic slim fits shirt that's kind of like what do you call it legally blonde the shirts that she wears in legally blonde and clueless that's the type of shirts that i need not not this like cool girls shirt it's just it's just not me okay so i didn't really have a shirt or kind of jumper or anything that matched underneath to put underneath this sweater vest but i really wanted to show it you because this one isn't a cashmere blend so it's more affordable um and it's super super soft it's kind of this like white cable knit with the kind of tie up 
at the side here as well excuse the bra um, and it was only £22 and I really like this I think with a pair of like camel trousers and a nice cream um, roll neck jumper or something this could be so cosy and cute I love the colour and it's so soft and I love the kind of argyle-y I always forget like what is argyle what is cable knit I don't know just that pattern where it's like knitted like knitted in a like patterny way you know what I mean um but yeah I really like this and I think it looks super cute with the skirt as well which makes me want to keep it even more but I'm going to do that thing where I style it with different things before I keep it uh, just to be sure because I know it looks cute with this outfit but will it look cute with loads of different outfits we'll have to see okay so obviously this was bought in mind of special festive occasions um, so you might recognise this skirt if you watched my last H&M haul I ordered this skirt and sent it back because I didn't like it um, I didn't like the fact that it was like super wide at the uh, at the legs like I just felt like the A-line was almost too exaggerated for me but then when I saw they bought out like a matching jacket I was like oh I'm gonna have to try it again because I can't resist a matching set and I just adore the buttons like I really am a sucker for a sparkly button and these are just absolutely gorgeous and I was just like I have to try it as a set I don't even care if I didn't like the skirt the first time round we will give it a second try just because it has a matching jacket um, but I'm still not absolutely Absolutely loving the skirt I don't know whether it's just because it's black that it feels big like I, I think there's like it's just very stark and you notice that it's wide because it's black I don't know if that makes any sense um, but the skirt was 29.99 so around 30 pounds uh, the jacket was 39.99 so around 40 pounds and the top that I've got paired with it I want I saw this top on the website and it was just kind of recommended to me um, it's not something that I would usually pick up it's actually just kind of like a black um, kind of lurex lurex <laughs> what is that um but like it's just like a sparkly black top with silver running through it and I thought it would look cute with the sparkly buttons I just I was just feeling very festive when I placed this order I was getting way too excited because I've been ill for so long and I was just like festive wear festive wear and this isn't it I don't know I, I, I'm just not feeling it I really like the jacket and I feel like with the jacket with a little slim fitted black skirt with some cute little black glittery tights or something that would look super cute but I'm just not feeling this skirt I don't know what it is it's crazy I just I'm not I don't know let me know what you think do you like it is it me just being weird because sometimes I look back on the filmed clips and I'm like oh it does actually look nice and then in the mirror I'm just like I look like I don't even know like a big black splodge I don't know <laughs> I don't know but I'm just I don't know I'm not feeling it I do quite like the jacket though so I might style it up different ways to see if I like the jacket and like it enough to keep it but on to the next items I think I don't like it <sighs> so I have on this just a plain kind of long sleeve roll neck um, this was only £10 and it's just in this camel colour and I thought it'd be a great kind of basic to have in my wardrobe and a great layering piece um, so I think I will keep this but the dress, I had such high expectations for this dress I thought it was going to look like a really cute little autumnal Parisian little pinafore obviously going with my schoolgirl vibes again but it just looks like a bad uniform like a bad uniform or like I look like a teacher or something I don't know the neckline's wrong, the, the the fit is wrong and the length is just all wrong. It just doesn't look nice on me. Um, so it's this kind of plaid, plaid dress, uh, pinafore thing that was really hard to get on. I kept getting my arms stuck in this zip. Um, I like the the um, pattern on it, but I don't I don't like the fit and I don't like the style. Um, I thought I'd try and spice it up with this belt, but clearly my efforts went to waste um, I just wish it was shorter and had like a normal neckline like it looks cuter shorter but it just 
I don't know, it just does not do anything for me. I look about 30 years older. I, it just looks horrific. Like, not nice. Like, ugh, no, I need to get it off. Um, if you're taller, this might look cute on you, but I don't know. I, I just don't like it, guys. I'm sorry. I'm going to have to take it off before I actually, like, die of self-loathing in this dress. Okay, yes, this dress is definitely a bit more me. Um... Guys, it's been ages since I've bought a jumper dress. I just haven't found any that have been, like, perfectly what I'm looking for. Cozy, flattering, and the right colour. But this is everything. It ticks off all of my boxes, and it was only £35. Well, it was cheaper than that because I got it in the sale. But it retails for £35 if you want it now. Um, but it's so soft and cosy and it's so flattering. I have it paired with my little belt um, that I'm obsessed with. I actually sent the one back from my previous haul because I wanted it to be a bit um, looser on me so that I could wear thicker clothes under it. However, I sent it back and then they then sold out of every size and then I had to reorder it in the same size. So here we go with the double extra small again. It's a little bit tight, but it's, it's, it's fine, you know? Um, but the colours pair really, really nice together um, and it this is just so soft like look how flattering it is as well it's such a flattering little dress let me take the belt off so you can see more um it's definitely more figure hugging than any do you know what I don't think I have anything this kind of figure hugging um and it's a nice length it doesn't really kind of cling anywhere it just kind of skims over the places that you want it to um I need to not wear black underwear with it but it looks really really pretty um i really like the color i think this is going to pair well with so many different um items and things like that so definitely a staple piece i just wish they had it in more colors i wish i had it in a white or a cream uh, a nice burgundy something like that i wish they had it in so many more colors because i would definitely get it um but yeah i really really like this so soft and cozy and super affordable definitely a winter must have for me um i really recommend i love it um, so definitely will be keeping this one. Okay, so we're kind of coming to the end of the haul now. Um, and obviously I've saved the best kind of items till last. That This skirt and the matching jacket, which I'll show you in a minute, are the whole reason why, why I placed this order. Um, I just loved the cream tweed. Obviously it's cream and it's tweed. I'm going to pick it up. Um, and then... The jumper is okay. Uh, the jumper was £25, I believe. Um, it's just a plain white roll neck jumper. I think I have nicer in my wardrobe, so I will not be keeping this. Um, however, I think it looks really cute with the skirt. Um, it's a very, very fine knit, um, so it's not going to keep you warm or anything. And it is really quite oversized. I've just tucked it into my bra. Um, but I only have it on really to show you the beautiful skirt that I have it paired with. Um, I have it on in a size 4, it fits perfectly. I actually tried a similar skirt to this, well it's the same skirt, I tried it on in my last H&M haul but in black and I wasn't that keen on it. However this one seems to fit better or I might just be saying that because I like the colour better, I don't know. Uh, but I think it's really, really pretty. Um, I love the little rhinestones running down the front of it. The A-line style is actually quite flattering. I feel like it's not as wide as the black one that I tried last time. Um, and even at the start of this video, I know I repurchased the skirt to try it on with the blazer. <laughs> but I really, really love this cream tweed skirt. So... Let's get the jacket on to see what it looks like because of course I can't buy the skirt without the jacket if a matching jacket comes with it. So guys, here it is with the jacket and of course I'm in love. This is the perfect festive tweed cord. You need it in your wardrobe. Oh my gosh, the jacket was £35 and the skirt was £25. However, as I mentioned, I got it in Black Friday so it's literally like... I don't know, like 30% off, which is amazing, super affordable, and it looks so, looks, <laughs> it looks so luxurious, like, I think the buttons are really, really, like, high-end looking, 
um, and the colour obviously, anything in a neutral colour I always think looks more luxurious and more expensive um, than like really colourful items. Um, but I think it looks really, really beautiful as a cupboard. Even with this cheap jumper underneath, it really kind of elevates the look. Um, but of course you could wear this with so many different blouses. You could wear it to work, dress it up, dress it down. This is gorgeous and I will be keeping it, of course. Um, but yeah... I'm so happy with it. So just quickly before I end the video, um, and whilst I had this skirt on, I wanted to show you this jumper. I know I've included a lot of kind of basic knits in here, but I really needed to replace my old knits, and Black Friday was the perfect time to do that because everything was reduced, and I could pick it up for a more affordable price. Um, but all my knits are kind of looking a bit tired, um, so I really need some new ones, um, especially going into the really, really cold months of January and February, I'm absolutely terrified. Um, but it's just this really basic kind of oatmeal cable knit type roll neck. Um, really, really cosy, um, super relaxed. You can kind of dress it up with a pair of smart trousers for work or just wear it like really casually around the house with a pair of joggers. It really doesn't matter. But I think I definitely will be keeping this because I can see myself getting the wear out of it. And the material's so soft and cosy that I think I'm just gonna keep it on just now. So guys, unfortunately, that is the end of the video. I really, really hope that you enjoyed it. Please let me know your favorite item or items down in the comments below. And also, I would be really, really grateful if you could let me know some fashion video recommendations or videos that you would like to see that are fashion related. I'm running a bit dry just now, um, so I would really appreciate your input. Um, but other than that, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.